Hey, what's up guys? We're out here at the park today. We're here with uh, Devin Graham. Hey guys, long time no see. And Sean Duras. It's oh, his hey, birthday today. Oh hey, long time no see. Hey, happy birthday, bud. High fives. So we are back here with the Sky Blaster Slingshots and we have some of these little novelty balloons. You may have seen these floating around the stores. These are like bunch of balloons or battle balloons or balloon blasters. Yeah. They go by like a million different names, but do they actually work? I don't know, that's what we're gonna figure out. So here's the deal. Last year when I made these things, I actually tried filling these up and I didn't really have much luck or success. The idea is you attach these things to your hose and you can just turn them on. The balloons will fill themselves up and when they're big enough, they'll just drop off automatically. Kind of like fruit dropping from a tree. Yeah, sounds good. And then they're good to throw, right? But what I found in my experimenting was when you throw them, they don't really pop. They're like super hard balloons. <laughs> and so if you throw them or shoot them at somebody, they'll leave welts all over your body. Well, this is gonna be fun because we have lots of friends coming. We have what's inside, Devin Super Tramp, a whole bunch of friends coming over. So we're gonna have a water balloon fight. And we're gonna shoot them at Devin because he's. I like to take that. It. I think Devin's the new target. I am the guinea pig for today. Yeah, I like that. We'll he, shoot he him see, at Devin. after that marshmallow blasting session. He's <laughs> I still have welts all over my body. <laughs> Test number one. One pink balloons. Hopefully this works. Is there a reason so, not for pink first, Grant? Well, because Devin handed it. Oh, and De the prettiest color. De Devin <laughs> chose sure. the pink. Okay, <laughs> that's what, why. What I think we should do is actually like fill this bucket up with water, so when the balloons drop, they have a soft uh, ending. Got it. Got it. Got and it. And this is really hot right now, and I'm not sure how that'll affect performance. It's okay though. You're hot too. Water cam. <laughs> Where's Devin? Oh. oh, oh shoot, sorry, I didn't know you were there. Oh, oh sorry. Watch out for your camera. <laughs> that camera's seen much worse. So these are the balloons that I used last year. I got them out of a Walmart. They are like red, blue, and green different balloons. And uh, I didn't have much luck with these. So let's, let's try them this year and see if they've made any improvements. The experience I had before is some of them wouldn't blow up at all. Uh, the other ones that did blow up and get big, they would like leak out. All right. Sweet. These already look different than they did last year because they used to be these like really cheap pieces of plastic. This is awesome. I feel like I'm about to go play Pokemon Go right now. Do you think right we should now. just let them drop off or do you think we should like let them drop? So like hold them up here? Yeah. It's like they're little babies. <laughs> No, oh, it's Pokemon Go. Look at all these free Pokeballs I just got. Yeah, honestly, this is a much better experience than it was last time. Yay! They actually all look pretty even, surprisingly. Yeah. And uh, they're filled to a pretty good size. I'm actually really impressed. I wasn't expecting that to happen. I was expecting like little baby dinky ones. Heads up, Lincoln. That's where we're going, right there. These are gonna hurt. They will? Yeah. Woo! All right. That actually worked. 10 paces, let's do this. Are you serious? Yeah. Okay. Seven, eight, nine, Five. ten. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Dang it! <laughs> As if it just bounces right off of them. Yes! <laughs> Back shot! 10 points! Yes! So all of mine bounced off of you. I don't know if you noticed. Well, that. I mean, that's because you just gotta throw them a little bit harder. I don't know if you noticed. Oh man! That was a low blow! <laughs> ah! Oh! <laughs> that legitimately hurt! <laughs> That one I got done with looked like it hurt. That was a cheap shot. I'm not even giving you a high five. Hold it like a bow. Hold it like a bow and arrow. Like this is okay? Yeah. <laughs> I meant to hit Sean. I promise. It's been a couple of minutes yeah. and some of these are actually losing mass. So I think they do have a shelf life. Like if you squeeze it hard enough, that thing will probably yeah. even pop up. Look at that. Oh, damn. You can make little squirt guns out of them. <laughs> Pick on someone oh, your own size. What happened to you? Did you just get dunked? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness, those are huge. Oh, that's how you do it. <laughs> definitely, definitely. If you fill up your water balloons in the water, it relieves enough pressure and they can get a lot bigger and these seem to break a lot easier as well. So I don't know if the name brand makes a difference, but we'll find out here. You now. Okay, so. <laughs> You're going down for that. Look at that. He just completely assaulted me. This is actually the kind of cap I was expecting because that's what we had last year. <gasps> oh! oh! <laughs> Sean Duras is about to feel the wrath. This is how it works, see? Little launch pouch made out of duct tape. Balloon fits right in there like so. Lock it. Oh! Direct hit. How did that feel? How did that feel? That was that was painful. That was my arm and it still hurt. These resistance bands are actually quite, quite strong. And in fact, this Sky Blaster slingshot I made here, this prototype, was actually my wife's workout band. Because I work out. I went down to her exercise room and chopped that up into a prototype. So thank you for letting me do that. I made a couple slight modifications from my video. You can see I, I shortened these middle pieces to three inches, which makes it a little more compact. And I used some 45 degrees here on the back. And what that does is it just gives you a, a little bit cooler look as that rests against your forearm there. And 
this one is painted with red spray paint, but you can use duct tape as well. I got some of this carbon fiber duct tape, and you can see it actually does just as nice of a job. Wait, what are we doing? Another round? Yeah, but uh, we have to use. How about shots? no shooting in the face, Lincoln? Check, Check this out. When the balloons are about the size that you want, all you have to do is give them a quick tug upward. Whoop! They're all, all gonna come off. How big do they actually get before they fall off from their own weight? Kind of weight? looks like white fruit growing on a tree, doesn't it? They're ready to fall. <laughs> I can, Look I at can that. feel them getting ready to drop. There they go. Yeah. Game on! Let's do this! Oh, my turn. Oh! <laughs> the smaller the balloons are, the better they're gonna work with the slingshots because they're a little more resilient. These bigger ones kind of are a little bit trickier. Let's get Lincoln. Oh! Pink packs a little more punch. Ain't that the truth? Okay, so our experience actually hasn't been too bad. It seems like probably nine out of 10 balloons will fill up. They do hurt like crazy though. I got hit on the shoulder blade by Lincoln. Where'd he go, that little stinker? Lincoln's on my team. So the bigger the balloons are, the easier they pop, which is a good thing if you're having a water fight. But if you want to shoot them out of the slingshot, smaller is probably better. Let's see how high we can go with this. Oh, nice. <laughs> the tree just got watered. Here we go. Oh, that freaking rocks. So these things have gone insanely viral. It seems like anybody who makes a video about them racks up millions of views, and they're really expensive, and I want you to know what you're getting for your money. Are they worth 10 bucks? 10 bucks. 10 bucks for a pack? I'd, I'd pay a good 750 for those. 750? I'd pay yeah. 750 for those. Right, there you go, guys, 750. If you can find them for 750, that's about what they're worth. But cleanup's a bit of a pain. I'm not sure if these things are biodegradable or not, but we went over here and clean them up just in case. And now there's a party happening over here. Sean Durst, his 29th birthday, guys. And of course, I High get five. the king of random to come to my birthday party. Yeah, slip and slide. Every base is a pool. Check this out. If you want to see the uh, water slide kickball, kickball, I'm totally oh getting in on this. God. We're going to go over to the Sean Durst. Oh, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> Come on over, we're gonna have fun, and Grant's gonna play also. 